Hello everybody and welcome back to The Sims 4 Rags to Riches. So today, well, she needs to go back to bed. Um, so we need to go to the Human Hijinks Festival and light some fireworks, which we'll do next time we notice it's on. So until then, we all just go out when invited, work on things, you know, let's get our money up. Uh, maybe we'll even move house in between, you know, who knows. I'm not sure when it's going to be, so that's always a thing. So we'll take ourselves a thoughtful shower in the morning. We will have some breakfast. We'll have some scrambled eggs with bacon. We will leave a note, we will read the note, whatever's there. And then we will work on writing. We shall write ourselves a nice science fiction book. There we go. All good. Nice little plan for our day. I'm sure we'll end up with people coming in and barging in with our day and leaving cups of water everywhere again, but that's fine. I've just got to accept that it happens. There we go, looking good. Yep, and we're even ready to go. Well, she may be cooking in the nude, but oh, there you go, she's dressed. Ooh. We've got rent to pay. And um, pay our rent. Afterwards, son. And read about the festival. Let's see what the festival is coming up. Even they. In a loy. Okay, I am doing. You know, it's on our list of things to do. Close it. We're going to write, we're going to pay our rent, and it will be good. There. And then we'll do some cleaning up. Once we've finished our writing, we may even do a painting today. Do a classic large after we've done all of that. You know, she's in a really good mood. It would be a good day to make a nice amount of money. I think, anyway. That's what I think. Oh, we need to level up our writing skill. Yes, how is your book going? Are we doing okay? Yeah? Oh, oh, oh no, I thought someone was coming over for a second then, but it's okay, they're not. Oh yeah, we leveled up our writing skill. There you go, we wrote a book. Um, afterwards, we will... Ooh. Ah, human hijinks. Monday, today. Excellent. Let's submit our copy to that. See if that gets us a lot of money. Okay. So go do those things. Okay. Um, very angry. Someone is very angry. Where are we going? We go. Oh, look, it's here as well. Oh no, it's not. Um, I want to go to the festival. Read about the festival, please. Come on, let's go. We need to light some fireworks. Travel. Um, we will take with us a few people. We'll take Penny, we'll take Parker, we'll take Marcus, we'll take Eric. And we'll take our landlord. There you go. Off we go to the Human Hijinks Festival. Hopefully, we'll get everything done. You need to light three fireworks. Ah. 
And here we are. We're at the lock. Everybody is coming with us. Okay. Good. Good to see. Right, we have some fireworks in our inventory, don't we? We do. Place in world of light. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, we want to be over here first. Okay. Place in world of light. Okay, place in world of light. Oh, look. They did very little. What's this one going to do? Really? You're pulling that kind of facial expression at that? That was nothing. Um, play some world and light. I want to watch your face. Okay, then we are going to drink some tea. Today we're going to go for pranksters. So we'll go join the pranksters. Um. Okay, let's go and interact with people. Oh, you need a you need a tree. Okay. Um, I want to prank him. So what a new life. Mischief. Um Scare. I don't know. Go to that and then you can go for a week. That's fine. Did you scare him? Then go to the toilet, please. Yes, thank you. <laughs> and then we shall start performing some pranks. Convince the tea is poisonous. That sounds interesting. Let's do that. Dag, dag. Ah, oh, the joke is the joke is wet. Oh well. We didn't have enough time to do everything we wanted to do. So paint a mural here. That was one of our things we need to do. Is there any that are left? Yes, that looks like there's one over here. Let's put the wall oh no, that's just the door. Um continue that graffiti. See if we can finish that off. So it get us a good step. Why don't you do, do something? Hello? Why can't I? Oh, okay. She is too uncomfortable. Fine, we'll go home. God. I just wanted to do something. But we'll go to bed. That's fine. There we go, we're back home. Let's go put her to bed. There you go, off to sleep you go. And then we'll use the loo, we'll take a nice thoughtful shower. We will cook some breakfast. Tomorrow we shall have pancakes. Why not? 
and then we will write ourselves a new book. We should do a screenplay tomorrow, I think. So, um, what points do we have at the minute? We have 900. Ah, okay. Not really enough, I don't think. A great storyteller. Okay, so that's fine. Uh -huh. There you go, we're up. We're about. There looking good. She is feeling uncomfortable from her bed, but that's fine. You have a bed. It looks nice in that room. And it's cheap. Just because we've got a bit of money now doesn't mean you're getting all the nicest stuff until we move again. That looks like our royalty report was quite successful. We're over the 20,000 mark. So once she's... We'll finish her painting, I think. And then I think we'll move house. I know we didn't spend very long here, but she is making a nice, reliable income now from her books. And hopefully from her painting too. This will be a masterpiece, it will get us a couple thousand. It will be good. Oh, we've got friends coming over. I thought we escaped them. They didn't come over yesterday. Okay. Um, it's not a masterpiece, but we'll sell it. Well, the good thing is we actually need some social. So we shall, you know, go and be a little bit social. Though she is drinking water again. It's fine, I guess, Penny. Uh, we'll have a deep conversation. We'll discuss some books with people. Oh, that we just became good friends. Yes, you see, I'm thinking of moving again. You happy with that? Oh, they left. Right, let's clean everything up. You know, whenever they come around, there's so much mess because they just leave water everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. So, what we are going to do is we are going to oh no, move household. Let's see what we can afford. I think we're going to aim for about 1,000, 1,500 a week rent. Make something a little bit more challenging. But we still cover that roughly in a day, so... I don't know. Ah, that's why we were living beforehand. It's the furnishings we're going to struggle with, but I might buy one that's not furnished. There's people in both of them. What about over here? We could move into that one. Haunted? We could live in a haunted place. Let's move. Um unfurnished please and we will sell our furniture okay so we've got a good amount of money to furnish this with so that's what we'll do something a little bit different cost us a little bit more yeah we will don't worry god okay I want to 
Maybe we can rid of some of these walls and doors. Well, we don't need all of these walls. Um, I, I don't know what this is going to be. So that can... Uh, can we not take out the walls? Why can't I get rid of my walls? Uh, oh, it's not our lot, that's why. I was looking at the wrong lot. Okay, this one's not so bad. It's a good size. I mean, I like having the two separate bedrooms, actually. Though, I may take off just a little bit over here to make the living space out a bit bigger. have it like this and then that can be a closet for that room there we go that's looking better let's just get in some lights to begin with so we can see what we're doing and so if we want to decorate it at all Okay, looking good. It's looking a bit dark and dingy, isn't it? So, we'll brighten it up, I think. Um, no, not with that. Though. I think we'll have that in the living space. And then in the bedrooms, I think we'll have this in. Yeah, that kind of colour. But we'll go. I want them going the other way. Um, the grey floors are a little bit much in the kitchen. Might have still grey, but a lighter grey. And then in here, I kind of like the idea of having like a stone floor. But maybe with some lighter tiles. Maybe this. Maybe not the stone floor. I don't think that goes anymore. There we go. I like the bathroom. Kitchen. Oh, this whole living space needs a lick of paint. We'll make it white for now. And probably keep it white. But we'll add colour in, in the kitchen. So going for grey on the floor. Oh, I like that. But it's not really adding colour in, is it? Adding blue. Blue looks kind of nice. Oh. That doesn't work, does it? I was hoping that would scale up a little bit with the wall, but it doesn't. Hmm. I have red. I think the red's a bit much. I think we will go for the blue. There we go. That's going to be our kitchen area, dining area, living space, and then two bedrooms. Well, study and a bedroom will probably have it as. Um, I think we'll keep the bedrooms the colours they are. I like having the nice bit of vibrant colour. Oh, but let's just paint the um, wardrobe. Okay, let's furnish that. Um, yeah, we'll start off with the kitchen. Okay, we're going to have that as our fridge. This is our cooker. And then we'll probably have these as our counters. Because I like the blue. I we'll have a nice end piece here. Though, so, I don't think it quite fits actually in the modern 
look that I want. We might just have these in blue. We could have these in the blue, but I might have them in grey. Yeah, I think we'll have them in the grey. Um, right, so let's just whack these in. And then I think we're going to turn this little bit into a little like bar section. Actually, maybe one counter back, actually. Um, excuse me, I want this. These. Yeah. So it's a little bit useful. Little small breakfast bars to have you. Oh, well, yeah, so you can have breakfast and stuff without messing with your big table. Um, let's get a big hanging light in the kitchen. What have we got that hangs nicely? We could have these. I think we'll have the mason jars. I think they look really cool. Really cool. And then I want to plant. So, oh no, maybe not. Now do we want some cabinet? I think we'll get some cabinets on this wall. I think we'll have maybe white ones? Or should we have grey? I think we'll have the grey. That must be a small one. There. That's just a little bit of extra interest to the wall. And we'll just stick that in there too. And then we'll also hide a few lights underneath them. Just lights up the kitchen a bit better. I mean yeah you can still see him but I'm not really that bothered today. It's not a perfect build. Right, so dining space. I think we'll have this table here. Look, she's having an actual dining table this time. You are moving up in the world. There we go. Nice dining table. And then some living space that I'm not too sure what we're going to do with just yet. Um, hmm. We get a big sofa. We have this one in all. all, all yeah, we'll have the white and black. I think that suits. We'll get that and we'll put a telly on it. There you go. Nice and easy. And we'll just get a plant to go next to it. It's the idea. This space has to be really livable. And stuff like that. So this is going to be a study and this will be her bedroom because it's got the space for a wardrobe. We'll have a nice wardrobe in there. And she can have a slightly nicer bed. There you go. Look at you, you're going to have so much comfort. It's going to be lovely. Just stick two of them in and it's all good and here is where we're going to have a study and stuff like that so we are going to get ourselves an easel I might even get her a chess board so she can play chess if she wants to from time to time we want to have a desk and her computer obviously we'll get her the best computer she can have chair. Now what else can we have? Let's go, ooh, let's have our own little karaoke machine. I think that will do. So there you go, there's her new apartment. It's okay. 
I will get the job done. I like the kitchen area. Let's just get a little... Oh, hang on. We're not done at all, are we? We haven't put a bathroom in. Oh my god. We nearly left without a bathroom. I think we'll have this. A nice shower bath. And then have a sink. There you go. She has a bathroom now. Ooh, that was close. Right, the mood. And there you go. A nice little screenshot of a new kitchen. So, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Rags to Riches. If you have, please leave this video a like. If you'd like to be, see more, please subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.